Buffington is here at Douglas County Corrections right now. Today, a judge setting his bond at $50,000. And tonight, the husband of one of his alleged victims is sharing their story. Jake Ritania and his wife went to Oasis Massage and Spa last week for a couple's massage. I scheduled it for the day after Valentine's Day. It's a place the pair visited many times before, but they say this appointment was different. My wife didn't say anything at the time, but uh, I could tell that at the conclusion of the massage, she was just ready to get out of there. Later that day, she said, hey, I really want to talk to you about this because I something occurred during the massage and I don't think it was right. Ratanya's wife didn't want to speak on camera, but he tells us she described inappropriate contact from her massage therapist, Melvin Buffington. Jake Ratanya says he was in the room when it happened. I was two feet away. Ratanya is an Omaha police lieutenant and says when he inquired with others in the department about the incident, their message was clear. And not only did, uh, did uh, the detective uh, that I talked to confirm that, yeah, I, I believe it's going to be a, a third degree sexual assault, uh, but then also confirmed that they had, they were already looking at Mr. Buffington uh, for a earlier allegation. The 62 year old suspect now faces seven counts of sexual assault, one of them first degree in a case last month. The rest are third degree. Douglas County Attorney Don Klein explained the difference earlier this week. Third degree sexual assault is contact, uh, first degree sexual assault is penetration. Ritania and his wife are also frustrated because Buffington was their massage therapist at Oasis five days after a police report from another client. Now they're hoping others will always have the courage to speak up. If it doesn't feel right, it probably isn't right. Now, the first report against Buffington comes from that case last month, and the Ritanias filed their official police report since then, an additional five charges against Buffington. Now, I spoke with the owner of Oasis Massage and Spa this afternoon. She says they are cooperating with authorities, and she has no other comment at this time. Back to you. Okay, thank you, Alexandra.